Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at a newly announced, soon to be released, switch gun made by Standard Manufacturing. It is currently in its folded position. This is a 22 Magnum, a five shot, single action revolver, very lightweight, pocket carry gun, don't need an additional holster or anything like that. Trigger guard is fully covered, but the reason it is called a switch gun is because that lever right there, you push that down and out comes the revolver. Check that out. It has a very quick and deliberate deployment. You have to hold on to this thing or it'll go flying out of your hands. It has a polymer grip here. It offers full three finger contact, which I find pretty nice. Okay, when folded, hitting this lever, it'll fold right down, lock into place. It's very small, but in this position, it turns into pretty large. Now, my reference for saying that is that the three-finger contact is nice because I have a North American Arms Pug. Had it for a while. Same concept, 22 Magnum, single action, revolver. But you literally hold on to it with like a finger and a half, right, like this. Not so much with the switch gun. You get a better grip of the revolver. It has a tunneled rear sight. A little opening right there with a fiber optic insert. Hard to pick up. Not much to talk about there. It's really not something you're going to use. This is a get off me gun. It's a belly gun. It's a four feet away gun, you know, like. Uh, maybe even a, a last resort gun when you when you have it deep concealed. It's, it does serve a purpose. There's no doubt about that. 0.88 inches wide. So not quite an in wide. Barrel length, I should say. 0.88 inch barrel length. So you're not going to get the, the greatest accuracy. When I took it to the range, I didn't even shoot at targets. But what you will get is a deep concealed, very lightweight 22 Magnum revolver. Let me show you how the switch gun disassembles. Go ahead and get it into position. It's unloaded. You take this pin here, pull it down, and then out, and then out will come the cylinder. There's your five shot cylinder. All right, and then to reassemble, get it into place or close to it, put that pin back in. And just like that. Let's see how much this weighs. Standard manufacturing says nine ounces loaded. So the unloaded weight, eight and three quarters. So it's going to be a little more than nine. Grab these 22 Magnum. And we're looking at nine and a half. So I've got a, a, a half ounce heavier using this arms core. 22 Magnum. But let's go ahead and check out the North American Arms Pug. So we have nine and a half there. Here we have eight and a quarter. So an ounce and a quarter more with the switch gun. Probably the equivalent of some pocket change. So I don't see any great difference there. There's a closer look at the grip. It has some cutouts in there. All right. And then here are the sights. Well, I meant to say sights. Sight. It really doesn't have any sights. You know, nothing on top of the frame. Has that tunnel there. You're not going to be aiming this, that part, I guarantee you. Close look at the hammer and the very small trigger. The trigger does have some serrations on it. It's a bit heavier. I think a lot of pocket guns have intentional heavier triggers. Even though the trigger guard, or no trigger guard, this is the trigger guard. The whole trigger is covered up completely when enclosed. It's still a heavier trigger, so when you pull that, it, it strikes that rim pretty hard. This notch here is what will lock up into that area right there. So all you do is lock that up and it locks up nice and tight. So you can literally do this all one hand to take your five shots, lock up just like that. I actually did that at the range. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. This is a standard manufacturing switch gun. Works just like a switch blade. That lever right there, you just push it down. And now comes a 22 Magnum single shot revolver. Pull the hammer back. And then this lever here 
flip that up and it comes down just like that locks up nice and tight all one-handed use the switch gun nine and a half ounces loaded you throw this in the pocket hit that lever and you have the switch gun now considering also that this is all stainless steel all right it's cnc machine stainless steel it's not aluminum it would actually be a little bit lighter but i think it offers more than the pug either of these don't you even consider target practice all right like when you shoot a little revolver like this with an inch long a little little less you want to get right right around here you know the small groups just forget it you're, you're not going to get that but you will have a self-defense tool i actually think the switch gun offers more than the north american arms pug primarily because one you get a, a better grip and two you don't need a aftermarket holster it comes included with a holster and encases itself just like that so there it is msrp 449 that's the current msrp we'll see what happens in the future i think people love innovation i know they do and people chase after something that is very different this is a switch gun it is very different i think it's cool in its own way i would use it as a backup or even in those summer months where you throw something in the pocket you don't want anything bouncing off your leg as you walk i think this would be a pretty cool little choice it it, it operates there's no doubt about that and it folds up nice and tight switch gun i plan to do some more work with it if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe